going to do a little walkthrough of the features that does work with the uh, Darkstone Android 2.2 build. Here we have the home screen. This shows you the uh, the phone does charge. It's at 77% now. We'll come back later to see where it sets. Uh, first thing I want to touch on is the music. People have said that it plays like uh, as if it's too fast or something. So let's just check out some music here. Here's another track. I mean, to me, that sounds like it's uh, normal uh, speed for the music. So we'll stop that. Let's check out this uh, news and weather widget that I have. Uh, you can swipe just from page to page. Entertainment, sports, U.S., top stories, and the weather. Also, GPS does work. I'm going to go to Google Maps here. Uh, let me search for my location. You see the GPS icon up top going. And there's my location on the map. I'm going to do a navigate here. Uh, actually, let me go back. Let's use the Google browser. We're going to do the voice search to navigate to some place. Navigate to Best Buy. Navigate to Best Buy. Navigate to Best Buy. I don't know what's going on, but it looks like we're having an issue. <laughs> Navigates the Best Buy. Let's go back. We have a little issue there. Navigate to Best Buy. Howard. Navigates. Oh, well, it's, <laughs> it's uh, acting a bit finicky. But usually it does work uh, fine. So searching for GPS. See a GPS icon up there. Oh, I guess I mean, wants me to choose which one. I was waiting for something. And there it is. Just... Head north on North Hang Avenue toward West Devon Avenue. In 800 feet, turn left at West Devon Avenue. So yes, the GPS does work. We're going to use the mic to search. Best Buy, Howard. Okay. Look like that. We're going to click, say, navigate. Let's see what happens. North on North Hang Avenue toward West Devon Avenue. So yes, the GPS does work. I guess, uh, you know, I've been trying it from my basement, but now I'm upstairs, so I guess I'm getting a better signal. So yeah, the GPS works. Okay, we're going to check out the market here.
you go to my downloaded apps so you can see it does download apps you see I had a digital rain I downloaded there for live paper uh, live wallpaper so we're gonna go ahead and change let's watch on the page here I'm gonna change the wallpaper to the digital rain it's like a matrix style wallpaper So live wallpapers work fine. Let's check out the browser. Once again, we'll search uh, YouTube. So you can play it either this way or you could turn to landscape. So I just finished watching the Nicki Minaj or the The volume sounds perfect to me, there's no yeah, problem with it. Yeah, yeah. It's a it's a very fluid song, you know, I like it because like it's Skip ahead. It's very simple. It flows like it's not. It's not too much. Usually her videos. The volume are, sounds um, ample to me. Are, are out there, kind of like Lady Gaga. Let's uh, check out the camera. Take a picture. So yes, the camera works. You have a Facebook uh, widget, a YouTube widget. That's pretty much it. I mean, uh, so far I've found that everything works. Let's check out the phone. At least most everything. I'm gonna call my number, my house number. I'll put it on speaker. Anyways, let's check out the settings. Uh, I don't have ringtones on here. That's the thing that I don't really have working. So we'll go to when ringtones, phone ringtones. It says silent. Only silent mode is available. I don't have any ringtones. Except for those, for certain things. So I mean, I guess that's the one thing I have to work out to see what the problem is. But other than that, you could use this phone on a daily basis. I've been using it pretty much this like whole I day. Said, like I said, we're gonna come back and check the uh, power. You know, the charging. It was at seventy-seven percent previously. I see. Now it's at 79%. So yes, the phone charges just fine. Thanks for watching.